Hello, governor. I'm Jay Klein. I am old. And today we have a special guest from over. I can't do it. I can't keep an accent <laughs> for like five seconds. But um, here in the back, in the captain's chair, is uh, my sister, Sarah. Hello. Won't say last names because we're on the internet, trying to keep it confidential. <laughs> um, but so she's a fan of the show, and I guess she wanted to get in on the burping and nausea. So yes, burping and nausea. Oh yeah. Good stuff. Every once a week, I know I can be incapacitated for the rest of the day. But so, as a uh, a bit of a fallen treat, you might saw it. Jesus, stop me now. Um, she brought over a few um, delightful snacks that you can are UK exclusive. You know, it's like a UK exclusive DVD or a for snacks. It's a hot can. So um, we'll go through these first, and then we got her a few treats from uh, American stateside to uh, make the guts bubble in a way that only. Uh, United States snack can. Um, so, as as the foreign adversary, what would you recommend starting with? I would recommend starting with the uh, the spotted dick and the hot custard, Jacob. <laughs> All right, let's pour some cream over our spotted dicks. We've got aunties, uh, deliciously moist, <laughs> steamed puddings with sultanas. What the hell's a sultana? It's like a raisin. A, it's like a raisin. Well, then why does it say sultanas and raisins? It's like a special raisin and a regular raisin. <laughs> uh, spotted dick. Um, not terrible. Um, what have we got? Well, I don't know. I haven't tried it yet. Uh, invert sugar syrup. That's always fun. 6% sultanas and 6% raisins. Raising agents. So these are all um, not our usual fare. We're more of a crack open a bag and eat it kind. And this is all very preparatory. So we've done the Ray to Ray thing and had these, uh, at the gracious effort of our guest, uh, had these things pre-prepared. Take those out of the oven as we put the uncooked ones in. <laughs> have enough stock for that sort of footage, but here we have the spotted dick and a toad. <laughs> it's kind of hot. I thought you'd like it, Jacob, because you cover your spotted dick in hot cream before you eat it. Exactly. <laughs> I, was, I was working my way up to that, you know, you have to wait for the porno music to start, and I was like, oh, uh, I assume the dick will come out of it. <laughs> you know, I always have trouble. <laughs> No, I'm not going to say that. Uh, I assume you serve it this way. Mm -hmm. Round side up. Mm -hmm. um, hold that. I'll get my... Well, I'll get yours ready as I get mine. Uh, here we have, at the same time, the Value Instant Custard Powder. Mix it with boiling water and eat it before it gets crusty. <laughs> so hopefully we've kept it preserved here. This is uh, preparatory work, so... Um, Hold your dick still while I dump my cream on it. Jesus. <laughs> <laughs> Go for the guess on that side. You want any more? No. You want on your face? <laughs> <laughs> sorry. Sorry, Tim. Sorry. Um, forks. I didn't grab a fork. Did it's I grab a fork that's in the cream. Oh, you got forks. You prepared. Ow. Taking the gloves off. So this smells kind of like a raisin bagel. That's hot. I don't smell no, that's probably allergy. Oh man, my dick fell apart. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Okay. What do you think? It's alright. Yeah, it's actually like, I was afraid because I've had raisin bagels and can get overpowered, but when it's got the custard on, even value custard, it helps to, like, make the raisins, I guess not less noticeable, but so they don't take center stage. Yeah, I could probably finish this. I don't know if we'll get sick today. It's not fun. <laughs> well, like a muffin. That's true. It's like, it's like a warm muffin, a moist muffin. That is called spotted dick. Alright. Put this to the side. Keep it flowing. Now here, we've got another delicacy. Cat is interested. 
This is by the makers of ketchup and relish. <laughs> We've got the Heinz Taste of Home. Super sticky. Is that treacle? Treacle. Yeah. Treacle sponge pudding. Now this is a boil a snack, <laughs> where essentially you'll probably get to see me burn my fingers here. Um, the can. <laughs> um, you actually boil the can for about 35 minutes, and you boil it in the can, and then the can's really hot. So look at all make these. sure to open the side that says open this side first. Oh, well, it says open this. Are you supposed to open both sides? Yeah, well you open that side first, you turn it onto a plate, oh. and then you open the other side and push it out. Oh, goodness, this is complicated. I should have got another plate. Oh, I'll just use my tea saucer. Yeah, I'll just put it in there. But watch out, this might spurt. Yeah, it does say to be careful. That came right like at me. This is all <laughs> steam, so I'm lucky today. No third degree burns to leave this episode with. <laughs> Looks like you took a can of cat food in. Well, no, I wouldn't say it's that bad. <laughs> At first glance, though, it's just got a little bit of... Oh, the can itself is sticky. Well, that's just the glue. Now I've got hot glue all over... Oh, yeah. I don't read instructions. <laughs> I just like to slap things out. Probably would work if he smacked it hard enough. Well, I think it might even be loosening just from me taking off the other end of the can. Oof. You know, we could just eat it out again. <laughs> you still got your fork, right? <laughs> Might as well just... Why, is it all collapsed? No, it's in there. Oh, okay, cool. And you can put custard on that as well, but you don't have to. That's true. Well, I can only stomach so much custard. Kenny, don't step in my... Oh, God. Don't don't get your hair on my dick. Oh, damn it. <laughs> damn it, cat. Oh, my. Oh. oh. <laughs> Use this if you need to. <laughs> Mm, crumbed up, so. Nope. Well, this is good too. It's got sort of a, a similar, I mean, texture. They're both boiled and steamed, so you get a similar out from that. Oh, you've got custard, might as well make use of it. Cat boy! None for you. <laughs> that looks rank. <laughs> Alright, well, while I dine on this and, and showcase these here, as we have often been purveyors of gummies in the past, uh, oh, <laughs> sorry about that. Uh, I gotta change these pants anyway. So always wear a towel. Oh god, it won't dry off either. There is a towel there. Yeah. Oof, about to cause disaster here. We got, um, can't go away. Teeth and lips. Teeth and lips. <laughs> the lips don't seem so bad, but the teeth gummies seem a little... A little... Too detailed, if you ask me. Delicious. You see, they've got the alligators, teeth and lips. Apparently that's what they are. Unless they're just the mascots for the best teeth and lips you can get these days. Do you like some teeth and lips? I would take some teeth and lips. My lips have got herpes or something on them. Oh, I got lots of teeth and not like... too many lips. Do you want some teeth? <laughs> oh, you got some teeth. Now I've got plenty of teeth. <laughs> it's a candy that can eat itself. You gonna eat it? Yeah, I thought you did. Top. I've never been a fan of top gummy. My favorite's pretty good, but. I think I'm going to be chewing on it for a while. <laughs> Was it the lips? Both of them. Oh. This is the teeth. The teeth seem more soft. Yeah, it's true. The lips are a little tougher. The dog can be out of the way. Well, now to finish, fin now finish it off with an English flare. These are all wet, too. <laughs> oh, not on the duke Damn it. I tried. Um, we've got... These are called penguins. They're like little um, uh, chocolate biscuit type things. And there's a special way you could eat them. There's tea in here, and I don't know if you're all about it. It does have like six scoops of sugar in it. So. I don't like tea. All right, well, I'll pour you a cup of tea and myself a cup of tea. But what you can do with these penguins is you bite a corner off each side and then drink a hot liquid through them. And then as it's in there, you put the whole thing in your mouth. And it's, and it melts into the chocolate deliciousness. It's good on its own as well. So, is there cat hair in that? 
I don't know. I'll have to check before I eat the rest of it. <laughs> oh! Oh, my shoes. <laughs> Sorry. I got it all over my leg. Oh, shit. <laughs> How uh, can I open it? Ooh. It works. <laughs> Just try to remain our dignity. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe you should take the stopper out, Jake, and just pour it over the uh, metal lip. Possibly. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Jesus. 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 God. Take my hand, my dear. Now this is P and E T, which we P G tips. P G tips, T, which you can actually get over here as well, even in our local grocery. A shocking surprise, um, sweetened with sugar and milk. It tastes quite good. I'm gonna pop open my penguin. I don't know if we want to clear the table for the unveiling of the American snacks here, and I try to work my way. I haven't really been keeping track of time. Should we just keep rolling? <laughs> yes. Okay. Uh, uh, just on top of that, then I'll work. Mmm. Oh, cool. Oh, cool. Beauty. I'm not gonna put that on my bed. Do you like my reverse teacup style? I like that. 